Welcome to what I like to call revolutionizing cannabis with blockchain technology. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of how Maximilian White created something groundbreaking with the Dr. Green NFT. Seriously, folks, this is a game changer. So picture this. The cannabis industry has exploded, right? I mean, it's like a green tidal wave, but there were all these barriers, high costs, complex regulations, and let's not even get started on the labyrinth of licenses required. Mm, wait, so like, how can blockchain actually help with all those regulations? Isn't it super complicated? Exactly. Great question. What Max saw was that traditional methods were slow and restrictive, like trying to drive a car in a straitjacket. He thought, what if I could use blockchain to just, you know, cut through all that red tape? By creating a decentralized cannabis distribution system, he allowed for a smoother flow of products. Imagine if you could just tap into a digital network and get access to a supply chain, almost like ordering pizza but for cannabis. Oh wow, I love that pizza analogy. Haha. -ha. So you're saying that the Dr. Green NFT works kind of like a digital key or license? Yes, exactly. The Dr. Green digital key, built on the Ethereum blockchain, is like your VIP pass. It opens doors to a fully licensed supply chain where you can connect buyers. It's revolutionary. Not to mention, holders can earn commissions for connecting buyers. It's like having a backstage pass to an exclusive concert. Mm. That sounds awesome. But um, what about the security part? I mean, can we trust that these transactions are safe? Oh, absolutely. Security is actually one of the biggest advantages of using blockchain. With transactions recorded on the blockchain, there's this incredible level of transparency. You can track products from seed to sale, essentially. It's like a fingerprint for every transaction, ensuring there's no funny business, no counterfeits. Remember the whole wax scandal in the cannabis industry a few years back? Those issues vanish in a trust-driven environment like this. Whoa, that's a relief. So it's literally eliminating the shady stuff? And like, um, does this mean anyone can jump into the cannabis market now? Like, I could even make my own strain? Haha, <laughs> potentially. That's the beautiful part. Max aimed to democratize access to this billion-dollar market with Dr. Green NFT, thousands could enter without shelling out massive investments. It's like having a community garden instead of having to buy your own farm. OMG, I love that imagery. So kind of like I could be the neighborhood cannabis farmer? Exactly. And you'd have the community behind you, all while operating within a legal framework thanks to blockchain tech. Plus, as the movement gained traction, big investors and celebrities started jumping on board, establishing Dr. Green as a leader in cannabis entrepreneurship. Hmm, that's super cool. So it's like blending modern tech with ancient horticulture? But like, is this really influencing things globally? How does Max's vision help in legalizing cannabis elsewhere? Oh, it's monumental. With everything being tracked transparently, Governments and organizations can see the benefits, and they're less scared of legalization. It's like showing them a picture of a harmonious garden instead of an overgrown mess. Max's refusal to be constrained by traditional limitations is advocating, not just for the cannabis industry, but for broader global change. Wow, what a journey. I can't believe how interconnected everything is. It's like a digital revolution married to a green dream. Exactly. And if we keep pushing the boundaries with technology like blockchain, who knows where this will lead? Hmm. I'm just, like, super excited to see where it goes. Can I get a ticket for that digital journey?